Hello, my name is Christy. I hope this is um, the first of many travel art videos that I'll be releasing. Um, but I talk a lot in my classes and here on my Instagram about um, the lessons that I've learned from my travel because I think a lot of them can be applied both to our art process and to our lives. Um, and one of the largest ones is our, our connection to everyone. Um, all, even though we are all so different around the world, different backgrounds, different upbringings, we are all connected. Um, and that connection to people is what I think we need to keep um, going back to. I think that we get so focused on the individual in our society and um, we forget about our greater connection to all humans and to all animals, to all plants, to everything living. And when we kind of have that broader perspective and we remember our connection um, to others, we were a little bit more mindful of how we treat everyone, um, how we treat ourselves, um, how we treat the environment around us. So I wanted to do a journal spread today on um, just our connection, you know, that we're all connected. All right. Thanks so much. So today's prompt is going to be a mixed media art journal. So I've collected kind of a color palette in acrylics that I might veer away from. And then I have some soft pastels um, right here on the left and some mixed media elements or ephemera that I can use um, really connecting to that global um, connection and the textiles. And then I printed out some photos from Unsplash, which are all royalty free of people from around the world. I wanted a variety of people, um, some modern, some traditional, some young, some older, just to give a variety. And I'm gonna be working in my Delusions art journal. So I'm just gonna be putting clear gesso down and then layering some mixed media and layering these elements before I add um, some of my art supplies. So as I put these layers down with my clear gesso, I wanted to really think about that deep connection that we all have and we all have to this world. Um, again, we get so caught up in our individualness and, and being different and our individual thoughts. Um, and I think we need to look a step back and look at that broader perspective sometimes of all of us being linked together. What are our commonalities? Um, it, it's so easy for us to be so different on so many viewpoints and standpoints that we forget how close we are all living this, this beautiful life. Um, and so, you know, living with that open mind. Um, and, and that is something that I've learned the most from travel is just having that open mind and realizing how connected we are as humans. Travel is, is so much more than, you know, experience and beautiful photos. And um, it really is these deep life lessons, you know, they're, they're humbling and um, you get out of your comfort zone. And we'll talk more about those, but connection is a big one. Um, even if you buy a souvenir, think of the amount of hands that have touched that souvenir um, and, and how now you are connected to all those stories um, behind that souvenir. So, you know, it's so important. I think we can bring this into our artwork. Um, as artists, I think we're all dealing with some of the same struggles and, and some of the same goals in life. Um, and so if we can kind of work together and, and build those collaborations and, and work with others, I think um, it's just such a beautiful, beautiful thing. So through this journal spread, I really wanted to, you know, connect these people and um, just show the energy of different walks of life. So I have, it's going to be very messy to start. Um, you know, I like to put 
clear gesso and, and come in with some mark making. I like to blend, um, you know, the clippings or the photographs a little bit better with some of my paints. So it with mixed media, it's beautiful that you can work from, you know, pictures that are printed out, magazine clippings, your own drawings, or just a combination of all of them. So I like personally to do a combination. So some stenciling, some collaging, some, you know, um, drawing um, some of my soft pastels. So lots and lots of different mediums. But I wanted to come in with textiles from all around the world. Um, and, you know, they're not necessarily go with the person, um, but just showing that, that, that we can walk around and wear different textiles and embrace different cultures and different people around us because um, there's lessons to be learned from every person and from every part of this world. connection we really learn compassion and empathy and understanding for other people um, and I think those are so so valuable um, in life to have them but you can see here in my mixed media I love to add lots of layers if you've ever taken any of my classes I kind of walk through more of the techniques um, but I love to do layers and layers and layers um, and and it's just to me so wonderful and freeing um, to just work so loosely. Um, and then from this, I might zoom in and work on one of these portraits. I might blow up one of these portraits and actually paint it in oils or, you know, do a mixed media piece, um, but more painterly. But this gives me a lot of ideas working in my journal spread. So I really encourage people to practice in journals for this reason. And it helps you with color palettes. It helps you with texture. It helps you with mark making um, and, and just plain curiosity and exploration because that is just something that I think we all need um, as artists. The process of mixed media art journaling for me is a great, great way to experiment and, and to play. Um, and taking this, and this could be all you work on, or again, really um, picking out some of those items that you really love in your journal spreads and making them into bigger canvas pieces. I like to come in with, with lots of details with my white gel pen. Um, at the very end, I like to do that with a Sharpie or really fine uh, paintbrush with black or white to, to get these high contrast. But I love these dots um, that are really connecting these people. Um, but when we actually engage with other people, we, we listen to them, we're hearing their stories and, and in turn, we're growing and we are learning. So staying open, um, to other people's perspectives and again, hearing their stories, um, just can help you grow as a person and inevitably as an artist. Brene Brown quoted, connection is why we're here. It is what gives us purpose and meaning to our lives. For more art and travel related prompts and journals, please visit Christy Kensinger and join our newsletter for art for the global spirit.